Hello, everybody, and welcome back to a server. And today, I am going to be playing some more Wool Wars. So, I played this a few weeks ago when it first came out, and I had a really fun time. So, I decided I might as well come back and try it again and see how good I can do. So the thing about World Wars is it's really fast. So you go through rounds like really quickly. And already I see a jump boost right here. Oh great, this guy's got a bow. We gotta get out of here. Uh, let's go help out our teammate over here. Okay, never mind. Just knock the uh, the person off. Now I do have the uh, the tank class here. Oh great, I fell off. I need to get up to the top. I forgot what my uh, ability is. Uh, but we got to get rid of all of these blocks around here so we can put our wool down. There we go. We just have one more block to do. And that is one point for red. Alright, so the tank ability allows you to get, like, really fast regeneration. Uh, oh, there's iron boots right here. I'm not going to be able to get them because this guy's got a bow. And he's going to try and shoot me. So we're going to go up here. And this guy just put up a wall. How did you get a wall? Here, knock him off. Alright, let's go ahead and use our regeneration here. And let's get rid of all these blue uh, people around here. Oh, great. This person's got the tank as well. It's a 1v1. Who's going to win? This person put a wall over the middle. Okay, well, it looks like this person won the battle. Uh, but how are we supposed to break this? Can we break the wall? Yeah, you can break the wall. Good. Uh, I don't know who actually put that down. I think that might be the utility that has the wall ability. But there we go. That should be another point for red. Oh, no. Did they mess up the wall? There we go. So now we've got two points, which is really good. I might actually switch. Uh, what was the other class that I like to use? Oh, wait. There's a builder. Wait, is this a new class? I don't remember the builder being here before. That might be, uh, who's putting the walls down. So I'm gonna go straight for the middle here. Oh, great. Someone just hit me. I'm gonna go and activate my ability here. Oh, I got knocked off. Yeah, that did not work well. Uh, let's see. We still have two people left. There's one guy over here. We've got an archer, which is pretty good. There we go. Alright, that's gonna be, uh, victory for us. So there we go. We won the uh, the first round here, which is good. So let's go ahead and jump into another game. And I want to try out this builder because I do not remember the builder being there when I last played. So let's see what the builder is like. So we get a stone sword. We get just a chest plate. We get glass. And this builds a 3x3 three three wall. So that's how they put the wall down. I'm not really sure what the glass does. Oh, great. This person's got a bow. Really? Wall. There. Now you can't get me. I've put a wall down. So, I can place... Really? Okay. This is... I'm dead. Yeah, that did not go well at all. Uh, yeah, the bows are really powerful. Yeah, I don't think the builder is going to be that good of a, uh, a class. Look at this. Everyone on blue team survived. Okay, so here we are in another round here. Let's see if we can actually win this one. This person's apparently got a, a bow. Okay, that person just got knocked off. Uh, this person, we just knocked him off. I'm going to start going for some of the blocks here. Uh, so we can actually get some points. So we'll put some wool down. Is there someone else still around here? Yeah, there's a person down here. I'm going to see if I can take him out with the sword. There we go, I got a hit. Now, one of the things that they do have is they have hearts now. I don't remember them showing you, like, the health of each person. So, I think that might be another new thing that they've added. Also, where does this nether portal go? Wait, where am I at? Wait, what is this? You can teleport to a different spot? Okay, this is interesting. I didn't know you could actually change spawn locations. Uh, I don't really like the spawn location because I can't really get anywhere from here. Alright, so I'm gonna try and make my way up to the top here. The problem is you can't really get up very easily uh, with these crates. Oh, right, red's almost about to win. Alright, here we go. We gotta take these people out. There we go. We gotta start breaking this wool and place our wool down. 
There we go. Oh, great. There's another person. Come on. Let's get him. There we go. And that is another point. Perfect. All right. So let's uh, jump in again. I want to use this teleporter. Actually, I don't want to use the teleporter because this is a really bad spawn location. Oh, there is a speed boost right here. So I could use that to go to the middle. All right. Let's get the speed boost. And, oh, I can get uh, a bunch of chainmail armor. All right, that's going to be really helpful. I can get another speed boost here. The problem is you have to walk up this. Now, there's a bunch of people in the middle. Oh, great. I got to take out everyone here. Get out of here. Oh, great. I'm using my regeneration, and it did not work. Uh, did anyone survive? Nope. Okay, red got a point. All right, so going down on the bottom really isn't that helpful. So I'm going to stay on the top here. We've got insta health for our ability right here. So we're going to go around the side. Okay, apparently someone's already hitting me with the bow. Uh, let's go ahead and use our ability here and see if we can take out some of these people. Uh, let's get rid of this guy and now we can start breaking some blocks. Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and put some wool down. We'll go ahead and break this. And there we go. That is victory. All right, so apparently I won the uh, the most wool plays in the last round, which is pretty cool. So let's go in again. Now, uh, this area doesn't actually have a teleporter. So there's not really any other spots to go. Uh, now, we do have a stone pickaxe over there. I don't think I'm going to go for that. Uh, I'm just going to rush the middle here. This is not a very good map because... There's, like, so many different places where you can fall in the lava. Oh, wait. This guy's still alive? Uh, oh, right. We got people coming. Here. Well, they're, uh, over there, I'm gonna start breaking this and put some wool down. So that way, uh, we can hopefully win. Hopefully the other person's gonna defend. There we go. Keep him back. If we can knock him in the lava like that, we should be able to win. Here we go. Let's go ahead and break all these blocks. And there we go. That is another point for red team. So I'm the berserker right now, which is pretty good. Now this ability does actually give you a sprint, which is pretty helpful. Uh, because when you speed up your character, you can hit people easier. Uh, here, we gotta knock some of these people off. No, I got knocked off. Did anyone survive? Nope, no one survived. All right, so that's gonna be a point for blue. Alright, so here we are in another round. We're apparently on the temple map. Uh, so we've got another new map. Alright, so I've decided to switch to the, uh, the tank class here. Oh, right, someone just put TNT down. That TNT does a lot of damage. Now, we got another tank over here. We definitely want to take them out. There we go. Alright, so let's go up top and start breaking some of this wool. There we go. We got a point, which is really good. Now, uh, before we start the next round, what does the keystone do for this? Uh, gives yourself high amount of regen for two seconds. Okay. So the tank ability gives you a uh, regen, which is really helpful if you take way too much damage. So that's what all those particle effects are. I'm going to start breaking some of the wool that's here because uh, I think everyone on red team's gone. Uh, so there we go. That is another point. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're going to win this one. This is a, a really easy round. So let's go in again. Do we have a speed boost anywhere? I don't see one. Oh, it's instant health and stone pickaxe. I'm not going for any of those. We're going straight uh, for the middle. Now we also get extra health as a tank. I just realized there's only one person... On red team so here let's just put down this wool and there we go that is victory that was a, a really easy one right there so let's jump into a next round all right so the next round here is apparently back on the temple map so let's see if we can win this one because last round it did really good so I'm gonna stick with the tank class because that worked out really well last time the problem is you got to be careful with uh, how much health you lose dropping off of that area. Now I'm going to go and use my uh, ability here. So I want to do as much damage to the other players as possible. Uh, now we got to put this wool down. There's still some people left on blue team. Alright, there we go. We got that person. I got to get this wool put down. 
And, all oh, right, there we go. Okay, we got a point. That was actually a close round because uh, Blue still had like three people left, but no one was attacking us in the middle. So we were able to put a bunch of uh, blocks down. So let's go grab this bow over here because this is going to be handy for doing some damage to these guys. Now we want to do damage to the tank to start off with because he's got the most amount of health. And then we'll go after some of the other people. Oh, this person's like really hurt. Here we go. They're like one hit. There we go. We got them. Now we got a person in the middle. I'm going to let the uh, the other people go after them. And then we'll just go ahead and put some wool down here. And there we go. All right. So it looks like blue team's actually going to get a point here. We all died. Uh, but we still have two points. So all we got to do is get one more. And we could win this. So let's go in again and see if we can actually win. Uh, what kind of items do we have? We got stone pickaxe, and I can't see what that one is. It's another stone pickaxe. I'll take the stone pickaxe. It's pretty good. But you got to be careful with uh, how much health you've got. Now, everyone's using the tank now on their side. So they've got a lot of health. All right, I'm going to go and use my stone pickaxe. Oh, right. Someone else is attacking us. There we go. Oh, I died. No, this isn't good. There's one person left, and they're the bow class. Let's see. Can we take him out? There we go. Yes. Okay. This person apparently survived. Oh, there's another person. Okay. So that is another victory. All right. So this is going to be the last round for today. We're on the hilltop map this time. So let's see if we can actually win this one. Now, there is a jump boost over there, but I'm not going to grab it. I want to try and take these people out here. We're going to use our ability. Okay. We got to run. I gotta let the regeneration work. Okay. Well, it looks like uh, I died, but we still have one person left who is an archer. I don't know if being an archer is really gonna be that helpful, but everyone else is pretty hurt, so they might be able to win this. No, they got taken out. All right, well, it looks like Red's gonna get the first point here. All right, so here we go again. We've got a speed boost to start off with, so we're gonna go ahead and grab that. Now, we do have some uh, chainmail armor here, so I can go ahead and grab that. Hopefully, that'll help. Oh, let's t help out our teammate here. Oh, right. We got one of the uh, utility people. There we go. We got rid of them. All right. We got one person up here. Actually, there's two people up here. Let's see if we can take them out. Oh, right. I'm going to die from fall damage. No. All right. Well, it looks like uh, we were able to defeat everyone on red team, and we now have... Our first point. All right, so we've got one point now, which is really good. So let's see what abilities spawn in. We got pickaxes, which isn't really that helpful. So we'll go ahead and grab this, and let's run uh, to the middle. The easiest way to do this is just to walk down the stairs. So that way you don't take fall damage. Now, there is a person over there. Oh, I just used my ability way too early. Okay, well, I'm dead. I should have saved the ability there. So here we go. Let's see if we can actually get a point. If we can't get a point, then uh, that's going to be it for this round. Uh, so let's go ahead and get to the middle as fast as possible. And I'm going to start breaking some blocks. All right, we got a red person here. Okay, looks like we took out one person. And we can probably get this guy. Oh, no, I got knocked in the lava. No. Okay, who's left? Anyone? No, we got no one left. Okay, well, that's going to be a red victory. All right, so that's going to be pretty much it for today. Now, I did get a five-star mystery box, apparently, uh, from playing uh, some World Wars. So we'll go ahead and open up this, and let's see what we get. Hopefully, we get something good. Hopefully, it's not a duplicate. We got... Oh, we got a new gadget. All right, so this is apparently the parachute gadget that I got. So let's try it on top of this building here. So if I go ahead and jump off of the building, I should be able to deploy this parachute. Okay, well, apparently it just launches you up in the air automatically and you float down on chickens. That is pretty cool. So that's going to be pretty much it for today's episode. So I'm going to go and end the episode here. Just make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. 
Goodbye, everybody.